morning, it's Bob Mason from FX Empire and welcome to the daily crypto tech review of Bitcoin, EOS, Ethereum and Ripple's XRP. We'll look at the MACDs, the moving averages and the daily support resistance and pivot levels. It is Wednesday the 29th of July. Jumping into Bitcoin against the US dollar and the hourly candlesticks. Slightly bullish start to the day, going to need to see Bitcoin avoid a fall through the pivot, sitting at 10,928. To support a run of this first major resistance level sitting at 11.267. Good need to see broad based crypto rally, however, for Bitcoin to break out from yesterday's high that was at 11.263. So, barring an extended rally on the day, that first major resistance level and yesterday's high should cap any upside. In the event of a breakout, should see Bitcoin target 11,500 levels. Second major resistance level at 11,600 should cap any upside. Fall through the pivot would bring the first major support level sitting at 10,594 into play. Should see Bitcoin avoid second major support level sitting at 10,255. Looking at the MACDs, pointing to a slightly bearish day ahead, at least the morning. So going to need to see Bitcoin avoid a pullback through the pivot. The moving averages continuing to support this bullish trend form back in mid March, but again, failure to break back through to 11,200 levels should see a pullback through that pivot and leave Bitcoin in the red for a second consecutive day. Looking at EOS against the dollar, it's been a mixed start to the day. Gonna need to see EOS avoid a fall through the pivot at 29559. Support a run on this first major resistance level that sits at 3.128A. Gonna need to see broad based crypto rally for EOS to break out from yesterday's high that was at 3.0799. So, barring a broad based crypto rally, that first major resistance level should cap any upside on the day. Fall through the pivot, bring the first major support level sitting at 2.8319 into play. Barring an extended sell off, should see EOS avoid sub 2.80 levels on the day. Looking at the MACD, we're seeing a possible bearish crossover here. So it's going to be key for EOS to avoid that pivot. On the moving averages, we're also seeing the 50 MA look like it's plateauing. So we could see a narrowing against the 100 and 200. So a move back to 3.0 levels would give EOS a run at that first major resistance level. Otherwise, expect sub 2.9s on the day. Moving across to Ethereum against the dollar, also a mixed start to the day. Going to need to see Ethereum move back through the pivot at 3.17 to support a run at this first major resistance level, sitting at 3.27.86. Going to need to see support from the broader market for Ethereum to break back through to 327 levels and yesterday's high that was at 327.34. So barring an extended crypto rally on the day, that first major resistance level should cap any upside. In the event of a breakout, should see Ethereum move back to through to 330s. Got the second major resistance level saying at 338.12. Failure to move through that pivot. We bring the first major support level sitting at 306.81 into play. Bar an extended sell off, should see Ethereum avoid sub 300 and the second major support level at 296, however. Looking at the MACD, we're seeing a possible bearish crossover and we're seeing a narrowing of the 50 EMA against the 100 and 200, supportive of this early pullback. So a move through that pivot. 317 is key early in the day. Finally, looking at Ripple's XRP against the dollar, it's a bullish start to the morning. Going to need to see Ripple's XRP avoid fall through the pivot at 2287. Support around this first major resistance level, saying at 2379. Going to need to see strong support, however, for Ripple's XRP to break out from yesterday's high 23499. So, barring an extended rally on the day that first major resistance level should cap any upside. In the event of a breakout, should see Ripple's XRP target 0.24 levels. 
Second major resistance level at 2451 should cap any upside, however. A pullback through the pivot would bring the first major support level sitting at 0.2206 into play. Bar an extended sell off should see Ripple's XRP avoid sub 22s and the second major support level sitting at 0.2105. Looking at the MACDs, we're seeing a possible bearish trend formation for the morning, so we're going to need to see Ripple's XRP avoid a pullback through the pivot. The 50 EMA is supportive of this upward trend that we're seeing, however, so a move back through. Yesterday's highs should give Ripple's XRP a run at 24s.